and just looking at this alone on top of the board a yacht club on the actual yuga lab scene unless you've been living under a rock you certainly are aware of what an nft is or have at least heard of it and the fact that it has taken people from rags to riches overnight one such case is the board ape nfts what's so special about this nft collection why have so many world-renowned personalities hopped on board onto the board ape train and how did one man end up losing over two hundred and fifty thousand dollars due to this nft collection let's find out everything you need to know about the board ape yacht club nfts celebrities like snoop dogg eminem jimmy fallon and steph curry all have one thing in common they're all late members of the board ape yacht club a prestigious organization of 10,000 ape avatar nfts with a wide range of characteristics and qualities what makes basie a prestigious club for the time being, the NFT entrance price is 71 Ether per NFT. In today's money, that's roughly $260,000. If you spent any time online, especially on Twitter, you've almost certainly seen a Board Ape Yacht Club NFT. These act as both avatars and membership cards for online social groups. Basie holders are either crypto savvy enough to get in on the NFT craze early or wealthy enough to buy in now that the collection has gained cultural clout. These NFTs were just released in April 2021 and each one cost only 0.08 Ether or around $190 at the time. In addition to celebrities buying in, the Board Ape Yacht Club is increasingly becoming an off-chain brand. Adidas has also partnered with Base C for its first NFT campaign. A Base C mobile game is in development, and one of the club's apes was featured on the cover of the Rolling Stones magazine last year, making it the first digital asset to do so. So are there really 10,000 of these? There are two types of non-traditional art. First, one-of-a-kind visuals are sold as non-fungible tokens, much like paintings traded in real life. Consider the Beeple NFTs, which sold at Christie's for up to 69 million. Second, NFT projects like the Board Ape Yacht Club exist. These work similarly to Pokemon cards in that they take a template and generate hundreds or thousands of variations, each of which is rated according to rarity. In Base C, there are 10,000 apes, each with their own properties such as fur types, facial expressions, clothing, and accessories. On OpenSea, which is the primary trading platform for NFTs, these properties of the apes are displayed. The properties of each NFT will be listed on its page along with the proportion of NFTs in the collection that share the property. Anything less than 1% is usually seen as exceptional. The ape in the collection with the uncommon solid gold fur feature, for example, can be regarded as super rare. This characteristic is found only in 46 out of 10,000 apes, making them extremely valuable. As previously stated, the project's floor price is 71 ether, which is the price of a common ape. Golden furred apes are rare and hence demand a higher price. Someone recently paid 333 ether, or 1.36 million, for one of them. An ape with gold fur and laser eyes, both of which are sub 1% traits, sold for a staggering 3 million a couple of months ago, making it one of the higher selling apes from the collection. So, what is it that makes these NFTs so valuable? This is a challenging question to answer. The short answer is that, as with real-world art, value is very much in the eye of the one holding the art. So, let's begin from the beginning. Four anonymous users named Gargamel, Gordon Goner, Emperor Tomato Ketchup, and No Sass launched these NFTs in April 2021. When they first issued 10,000 of them, it only took 12 hours for them to sell out for $190 each. What makes Basie or any other NFT collection valuable is tough to pinpoint. It's a combination of three variables in general, celebrity and influencer involvement, community strength, and member benefits. The first one is obvious. When celebrities own NFTs, it encourages others to do the same. Jimmy Fallon paid $145,000 for a base C and used it as his Twitter profile photo. This resulted in a burst of publicity and sales. Then there's the matter of utility. The majority of NFT projects claim to offer some sort of utility, whether it's access to play to earn games or the option to stake an NFT in exchange for cryptocurrency. Another high value collection, Cyber Kongs, rose to popularity after allowing Kong owners to breed a baby Kong NFT with two Kongs, encouraging many more to join the club. The Board Ape Yacht Club has done a few things to keep owners interested. The Board Ape Kennel Club was founded first, allowing owners to adopt a canine NFT with characteristics similar to those of the Bored Apes. Another freebie arrived in August, Digital Bottles of Mutant Serum. By mixing their Bored Ape with the serum, owners can create a Mutant Ape NFT. NFTs from the Kennel Club and Mutant Ape are extremely valuable. The Mutant Ape Yacht Club collection has skyrocketed in popularity in recent weeks, with the floor price rising from around 4 Ether in November to nearly 20 Ether, or 65,000 today. 
Finally, and probably most importantly, the community that surrounds the collection. Board 8 Yacht Club meetups have been held in New York and California, as well as Hong Kong and the United Kingdom. In New York, owners were treated to a weekend of celebrities that featured an actual boat party and a concert with Chris Rock, Aziz Ansari, and The Strokes. Developing a community does, after all, have an economic side to it. Art, in whatever form, is only as valuable as the money people are willing to pay for it. In an NFT collection, the floor price is roughly the same as the lowest invested members' willingness to sell for, people who believe that they're in possession of a community token are less likely to sell their monkeys. Selling your ape involves an NFT, but it also contains a community pass, which many individuals don't want to lose. Furthermore, after achieving a certain level of recognition, these NFTs become a status symbol. Being a member of an exclusive club or possessing a certain crypto, NFT, or being a member of an elite club is likened to owning a Rolex or a super expensive sports car. Like Eminem and Adidas, people use these NFTs as their Twitter or Discord profiles to show the world that they too are NFT owners. You might think that if people can wear a $20 fake Rolex, can't they download a photograph of this NFT and do the same? The answer to that is yes, they can. But just like how you can look at a Rolex and know whether it's original or not, you can look at a picture and figure the same thing. Now, let's hear the story of the man who lost it all. It's painful to see an elite NFT get listed and sold instantaneously for a price much lower than it's worth. In the case of an individual, the NFT was accidentally listed for just $3,066 instead of possibly $300,000. Unusual deals frequently indicate shady dealings, like in the example of the individual who paid $530 million to acquire an NFT from himself. A simple deadly fat finger error was the cause in this case. The owner, who goes by the name Max or goes by the handle MaxNot, intended to sell his board eight for 75 Ether or roughly $300,000. Instead, he listed it for 0 0.75 a hundredth of the original price. It was bought right away. The buyer even paid an additional $34,000 to speed the transaction and ensure that no one else could buy it before them. The board 8 was quickly listed for $248,000 on eBay that same day. The transaction appears to have been carried out by a bot, which can be programmed to acquire NFTs listed below a given price on behalf of its owners so that they can profit from them, just like a very lucky buyer did this time. Max's only response to this unfortunate situation was that he probably had a lapse of concentration as he lists a lot of items every day and may have just made an error while listing this one. Unfortunately, before he could even click cancel, the NFT was sold. And just like that, he had lost a potential $250,000 payday. That's all you need to know about the Board Ape Yacht Club NFTs. Would you buy one if you had the finances? Let us know in the comments below.